What is going on, my peeps? It's your favorite crazy brain friend, X Recognition here, coming at you again on the motherfucking island. If you guys haven't caught the last episode, we tamed both of these guys here. Oh yeah, 217 and a 225. They are magnificent, they're beautiful, and they are going to help us defeat the bosses and move on to the next stage. Now, the thing is, we need to get whales. Because we need to get into a uh, water cave. And we need whales for the water cave. And in order to do that, we need to make some more kibbles. And our kibble production is poor. It's really poor, guys. We need to get a greenhouse over this thing here. We need to do some changes. We need to get some, maybe some Therasinos, get some more eggs going and stuff. We just don't have enough kibble. So that's also why I got these guys up, because we need to go collect some crystal. And I went ahead and got myself an egg incubator. I know I said it was locked on this map, but I went ahead and learned the engram with a command and built it. And along with the miner here. Yes. Always got to have that miner. Thing's amazing. But I think that's the only two things I'm going to, like, uh, use a command on to get an engram for. So, we already got a few things built. C a couple of greenhouse pieces in here. Got, a uh, seven ceilings, 19 walls. Nothing fancy. Uh, I kind of wanted to do a design with it. Kind of, like, peaked up in the middle kind of a design. Maybe make it like a two-story thing. I think that'd be kind of cool. But we'll see. I might just make it all just one big greenhouse because I think that's going to be plenty of production for us. But we will see. Now, if you guys haven't already, I would highly appreciate it if you hit that thumbs up button and subscribe. Make sure your bell is checked so you can see when I post next. Catch all the art content you need Ooh. all right let's get moving all right we got steve on follow we need to get fatty here following us thank you thank you all right guys let's go up to the mountain and get some crystal i got another rg on me in case we need some more weight distribution and I think the highest amount of crystal I've seen so far is on the mountain, like right next to us, which is over here. That one right at the top there. I usually get my metal up here too. It just recently spawned back, which is absolutely awesome. I actually went up there and collected some off camera, doing a little bit of off camera work, you know? Trying to bring all that delicious content for you guys. Delicious yum yum yums. All right, y'all, slow. Come on, let's hoof it. All right, let's get up here, see what we can see, find out what we can find out. All right, they're still keeping up. They're doing good. I hope there's some a lot of crystal up here. And with the help of the mining drill, it should make things so, so much easier for us. Thing was expensive, so hopefully it'll be worth it. Usually I would bring the Anki up here to collect anything crystal or otherwise. But not this time. We actually need to get a little bit of obsidian while we're out and about. A little bit of metal wouldn't hurt as well. That's why I brought so many birds. They all got like a thousand plus weight. So we should be able to distribute all of it pretty good. Oh yeah, look at all the crystal, all the metals. Oh, yes. Got a smorgasbord up here. No obsidian, though. I don't think there is obsidian on the top of this mountain. Which is fine. That's fine. That's okay. That's not a big deal. Just checking if everything's safe. Last time I came up here, I got attacked by... Uh, I think it was like three saber tooths. And then a Carno decided to start attacking me. Like, it was all bad. It was just... It was just poor planning. But I think we're all clear. I would love it if all you guys landed. So 
so we're gonna do that one by one. Thank you. And land. Shall we? All right, you guys do that. Now I can collect all the goody goodness. I absolutely love this mining drill thing. This is why. Oh, look at all that crystal. Get it. We're gonna be getting some metal too. Oh yeah. That's so much better than Anki. Anki does uh, reduce the weight a lot more, but not a big deal. That's why we got so many RGs with us. We're gonna bring a bunch of metal back, a bunch of crystal back. I used all the metal at it. This thing is so incredibly loud, I gotta shout over it. Ah! Cucumbered. All the cucumbers. Oh man, look at that beautiful view. Gorgeous. All right, Steve, what you got for me, homie? Take all my stuff. I don't need any of that. Sure, you can take mushrooms, too. Why not? You're almost full. More crystals? Need as many crystals as possibly can get. Take a little more weight off of Steve here. That's better. And put it on the fatty. Because he could take all the weight. Uh, Alright, what mountaintop? I think that one right there, that tall one, has a bunch of obsidian on it. So I'm going to go fly my happy butt over there. Go splunder my plunders. And I'll be right back. Alright, we're coming up on this mountain over here. Look at these two dinguses behind me. I'm too slow and fat. I can't make it. Alright, come on, let's get up here. I think I see obsidian around. Oh yeah, I see a bunch of obsidian. Oh, hello. <laughs> Trying to put your beak up my butt, I see. Trying to get frisky there, Steve. Fatty one to get, get a little something something. Oh, there's crystal up here. Oh, there's obsidian. There's ass ton of metal. Oh my god. This is paradise. Alright, before we venture on forward, let's make sure the area is clear and not get our faces attacked by things. Because that's uh, not fun. Not fun at all. I think I see a saber right there. He could venture upward, so I'm gonna kill him. Just to make sure. He's the strongest. She's the strongest bird I got. For that exact reason. All right, anything adventurous? I don't think so. All right, we can't load up too much weight on all the birds. I still have one more bird I could throw out. All right, let's park them. Uh, I don't really want him all the way at the tippy top up here. Let's put him like right here. Get the other bird out. Bazinga. Oh. Bazinga. There we go. Let's get you to follow. There we go. I think these two are already full. Oh yeah, they're both full. We just gotta fill up these two birds here. Slip Siren. Got two levels. And to wait. Alright, let's get it. Did someone say a little uh, collecting montage? Let's do it.
Alright guys, I think we uh, filled up all the birds here. We used almost half of our tool. We got that guy full. Charlie's almost full. He's almost full. Everyone's on follow. And I think we're all tapped up here. I don't have any more birds on me. I already checked. We got some crystal. We got some obsidian. We got all kinds of metal to bring back. Uh, where is space anyway? I'm kind of lost. Oh, he's looking the wrong direction. Here we go. Space is this way. Come on, fellow flock. Come on, fellow cacaws. Craw craw! Craw craw! Alright, this is gonna be like a eight year journey. Bring you guys back when we're there. Oh man, look at that beautifulness. Just been admiring what the Series X could do lately, and it's just like, wow. Absolutely phenomenal. Look at that. Anyway. Bear back. Captain's log. We're almost home. I didn't have to eat any chicken birds this time, but next time we're having us some fried chicken. Mm hmm. Captain's log out. Into the darkness. Alright, we're coming back up on home now. A full load of fucking everything. Oh yeah, we did uh, place all these vaults over here, replaced our storage, I forgot to mention that, whoopsies. Alright, let's uh, park Charlie over here next to this guy. Oh god, we're gonna have to just grab them one by one it looks like. They all have a little bit of metal on them, so I'm gonna try and park them like that, I guess. Oh jeez, might be an issue. Oh, I can't scoot under. Uh, let me get you. Mm, let me get you. Aha! I, like, push you out of the way or something? Move. Oh, you're solid. Okay. Alright, start emptying off the metal into the forge here. Since it is the heaviest. I don't carry, like, so and so much. Fatty, you're too high. I have to like jump off the vaults to get you. Come on, Indiana Jones. Yes! Winning! Alright, Charlie, let's put you in your spot, your designated spot where you sit all the time, right here. Being all majestic with your glasses. Ooh! Look at that, beautiful. Okay, let's get all my greenhouse structures. Got a few. I don't got a whole lot, but it should be enough to get a little something, something going. I want to try and make a two-tier thing so I could like never run out of goodies. All right, let's just take all that crap out of there. This, some of these. Okay. Go on over. What's up? Oh, we need light over here. This is not gonna work. I need light. Alright, let's go place these. Oh no, I'm cucumbered. I've never felt so overweight in my life. Can I get down the stairs without breaking an ankle? What's up, dung beetle? About to call you Fred. Let's get these torches placed. Probably like one right here. Let's see how much light this one produces right here. Let's see what we're working with here. Not terrible. Would like another one lay over here. Oop. Hey, dumb beetle, what's going on? In my way, homie. Thank you, sir. Now, I'm kind of wanting the door facing this way. Because, I don't know, it just makes sense. Kind of put it on this side facing where that door is. Okay, it's going to go right there. Go there. Well, what's up, homie? 
going to place it towards the outside floor here. Oh, I figured I couldn't walk through there. Okay. That's fine. Okay, you're in my way. Bam. Bam. Oh, poot. All up in my grill, man. Can't see. And oh man, I might need a lot more walls than I originally hoped for. That's all right though. He's like kind of in the wall. That help? A little bit. Yeah, that's better. Got my dung beetle patrol on the outside. <laughs> that's kind of cool. Open this guy up. Go like that. Looking good. Oh, we got a couple out of place here. Oh, wait, no. This looks out of place because glass looks so freaking weird. All right, let's get the left and right. I wanted to slant it up. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Just like so. And then for like the second story, I was just gonna make like the middle have plants on it, like the middle row at the top here. And I just like put the slants up like so. Have it like sealed off down here like normal kind of thing. But have plants on top and then have like a little like roof on top of that. Have it like a double roof kind of deal. Like a little double roof. Little doobie double doubles. Double doo doo. There we go. Should have greenhouse spec. Yeah, buddy. Aw, oh, I can't walk in here. I hate that. Because the crop plot's like right there. That's alright, though. We'll deal with it. Now, the top of this. We're gonna make it a little bit different. We might have to stick the dung beetle inside. To be honest. All right, homie. Are you going to be able to make it around? You can do it. Do you like Get in there. Get the hell in the door. <laughs> Gotta beat his ass sometimes, you know? Alright, now he's on Wounder. He is good to go. Actually, you take a little more poop. He's happy in his new little home. Alright, poop. We need a couple more poops. Thank you for your donation. I contribute it to the dung beetle box. The dung beetle tab. There you go, have it all. Have it all. He don't give a shit anymore. Ooh. Do something like this. Going up to the top, and then can go up to the plants up here. Ooh, I like that idea. I have to change this though. It almost needs to start back a little ways, but hmm. I start it like this. Over on this side. Eh, it's not gonna cooperate. All right, I think we're just gonna go with that. Then have us a little roof channel thing right here. Gonna have to figure out how this is gonna work. 
Oh, actually, yeah, we could just do this. Put, like a little section out right here. That would look nice. Oh, we're just gonna look from the other side. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. I like it. Is the metal done? No, not even close. Okay. Put a couple extras away. Oh, we still got the mushrooms on us. We gotta get rid of those. Put them in the fridge where they belong. Alright, we need some more walls. I'm pretty sure I have plenty of things to make walls. I do. Okay. So, wheat. Let's start with 10. Yeah, I think 10 will get it done. And we still got ceilings that will work. And I'm probably going to put a double door. Sounds like the winner. There we go. We got all of them. Gimme, 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 gimme. Alright, we're not going to need... Actually, I could slope it. Be kind of cool looking. <clears throat> but like... Door on here. Oh, that was really strange. It was like there's like a dust cloud or something. Okay. Okay, go like this all the way around, and then do like a slope kind of thing, like sloped one way. I think that would look baller. Yeah, I think that'd look nice. Oh, I don't have any sloped son of a beach. All right, we need to get some slopes. I just happen to have just enough, just enough to build out this greenhouse all the way. All right, we got our slopes. Thought I saw something weird, my bad. That <laughs> squirrel. I'm actually liking this. I like the little ramp thing going on back here. It kind of looks cool. It looks like weird at the same time, obviously, but I'm gonna leave it. Yep. Yeah, definitely gonna leave it. Gonna cooperate. There we go. Oh. And bam. Yeah. Now we have a little another section for plants to go in here. We can put one, two, three, four. Well, actually, we can make medium plots. Put a lot more in there. Sounds good to me. Let's do it. Let's see. How much does it cost to make a Corapa Plata? I have no idea. Oop. Crop plot. We only need mediums. Let's see, fiber stone thatch wood. Sounds like a plan. Fiber. Stone. Thatch. Wood. All right, how many can I make with that? Where are they at? Is this it? Medium crap pot. Five. I can make six of them. What am I missing? Wood? No. Edge? No. No. Hey. There we go. I made like eight of them. Might be able to stack like eight. So you can stack crop plots. I don't know if anyone was actually aware of it. I don't know if you can still do it. But like. If you look like all the way out and place it, I guess you could stack them on each other. But we're not gonna do that for this one because we're gonna go for aesthetics. Uh, I guess we could actually take this railing off here. No real need for it. So we can get up here a little bit easier. Now I'm hoping these don't block out the greenhouse effect for the crop plots below. Be kind of make me sad a little bit. I'm trying to make him straight. 
Eh, good enough. All right, we're gonna smash as many in here as we possibly can. Right next to each other. And we're probably going to do all veggies up here, since... Probably the best idea. Alright, we won't put a crop plot right here, just so we can get in and out of the door easily. But we could do citronel, one, two, three, four, five. And we have one extra for whatever. Probably citronel, because I use that one the most, it seems like. Alright, let's make sure everything's got greenhouse effect still. What's up, dumb beetle? Don't need you escaping. Uh, yeah, everything's good. Oh wow, you can see through them. <laughs> that is weird. Uh, noted. Crop plots above you in a greenhouse are see-through. That's interesting. Hmm. Alright then. All we need is irrigation set up here, and it's good to go. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have any seeds. So we're gonna have to go pick some up. Oh wait, no, they might be in the fridge. Alright, looks like we got some seeds in the fridge. Let's go distribute those and make some irrigation pipes. Oh, wrong button. And we're going to need vertical. I get like five of them. Five traps, five of those. And like five straights, ten straights, I don't know. I mean, we don't need all that much stuff, but we're gonna make a workout. How you doing, Poot? Doing quite wrinkly today, I see. Doing mighty fine. Oh, I'm in the wrong area. I gotta bring the pipes up from the bottom. Gotta go down here. We just gotta find the pipe that is like most closely lined up with this. Which like right here. Is that like super high? Like right in the ceiling, isn't it? Go check it out. Well, it doesn't look too bad. I think we're just gonna run with it. Oh no, you're going the wrong direction. I don't need you going that direction. Turn! Can I turn you? No? Oh. Uh, are you really gonna do this to me? Oh, there we go. Perfect. Perfect. And then... Tap here, tap here, tap here, and everything should be irrigated. Yes! Nice. Now we just need some fertilizer, courtesy of Mr. Dung Beetle. Thank you, sir. I don't know how much I'll need, but I'm just gonna take it all. I don't think we have any in here. Oh, I guess we do. Yeah, I'm about to just, like, get rid of all these, honestly. We'll do that a little bit. I'll do that off camera. Alright, let's get on in here. What is this? Citronel? We're gonna get one of each. On grass. Rock carrot. Save a root and another one of citronol. Because I seem to use that one the absolute most. So we're gonna get doubles of that guy. Alright, everything's planted, gotta fertilize. Let's get them all up to like 216. Good to go. Like they're already sprouting hardcore. So wheat. And we got a little extra fertilizer. Let's 
go distribute it in the main farm. Bam. How much are you guys producing now that you're in greenhouse? Seems like a lot. Oh yeah, I'm definitely digging this. Let's go take a little fly around it. Check how it looks. Come on, Charlie. I know you want to take a little fly around. Metal's still not done. Damn. Alright, let's check it out, Charles. Oh yeah. That looks good. I am glad I did the slant on the top. That gives it a very nice architect look to it. Little architect feel. It looks so good. That's noise. Alright, Charlie, let's go sit over here. Put you back in your area. I am stuck behind the air conditioners. Really? Really, Charlie? You done did this to me. Alright, now that we're out of that predicament now. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look at this guy. Looking schlick. Oh, you guys gave me an egg. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. Yes, more kibbles. Ooh, all the RG eggs. I mean, I probably won't use them for kibble, but I'll keep them. Keep them for safekeepings, I suppose. Alright, we are done with the greenhouse. I am super happy about that. We are not going to have time to get us a Yuda today. But... We did get another T-Rex egg, which is that much more kibble. Alright, we got one T-Rex egg, one Bronto egg, and we have one T-Rex in there ready to be imprinted. I will do that off camera. Get him all printed, imprinted up, and then uh, I think the T-Rexes are actually ready to mate. Yes, yes they are. Which means the Brontos are ready to mate. Yes, they are. Alright, guys. I think that's going to be all the time we have for today. I'm going to get these guys all mating up. Get some eggs created. Get some babies raised. Do a little bit of off-camera stuff. Man. Oh, whoa. <laughs> oh, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you had a great time. But until next time, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Stay excellent. Bye.